We're in the oldest rainforest in the world at the Dane Tree Discovery Center. Let's explore and learn. What I'm going to do firstly is to try and give you some context as to where you are and what you're surrounded by. Um, within the Dane Tree Lowlands there's several types or classification of rainforest, but the dominant classification is the forest that surrounds us here. And its official title is Complex Mesophyll Vine Forest. And each plant has to develop a strategy or a technique of getting from a dark place where they begin, which is generally the forest floor, up into a light place. For example, just behind us here, we have what we call a scrambler. It's a climber, really. And you'll notice at the end of each of its leaves, it has a coil. And these coils attach to surrounding vegetation, providing sufficient structural support for that plant to continue its upward journey. So I've noticed so far that nothing is actually touching the ground. We're above ground on everything. Yes, yes. We've uh, designed this aerial walkway. It was originally done in 3D photography in order to map the route through the forest cool. to uh, disturb as little vegetation as possible. And uh, similar to the tower that we're going to be experiencing soon, all of this was brought in by hand and erected by hand. No cranes, no heavy duty equipment whatsoever. Amazing. Yeah, slightly different perspective from up here. And um, even though it's a little bit overcast, um, at least me without any sunglasses or hats, uh, I'm squinting. And that's the very reason why many, many plants aspire to come up here. Because here the only thing that's going to interfere with the quality of light are clouds. So this literally is as good as it gets in terms of light regime. This tree looks like it belongs in a grim novel. <laughs> very dark, very mysterious. It certainly does. Um, this really demonstrates how tenacious plants can be in this rainforest. And this is what we refer to as a strangler fig. Those hair-like structures become massive root structures that we can see here. And they become so large that they actually start strangling the host tree. If I was to go over there, I could step inside. It's hollow. And it's hollow all the way to directly above us here. Chris, this was very informative, very fun. I learned a lot, a lot more than I thought. I mean, there's so much to learn here. You just barely touched the surface today, right? There is. In, in 17 years, and I know about that much, but um, it is a special place. Well, thank you for sharing your backyard with us. This was fantastic. You're welcome. You're My welcome. pleasure.